Uh, hi guys, this is me Baba currently from the Indian Foodie and welcome back to my channel. We are in Durban in South Africa and we are here for something exciting. So we are going to do a tour of South African food and we have this famous place called the Hollywood Pets here and we are here to eat something very special. So let's go in. So finally the bunny chow is here and this is how it looks and uh, bunny chow basically is a piece of bread as you see the loaf the loaf of bread you know and they take out the middle part of the bread you know and they put all the curries masalas you know in it and what is interesting is how you're gonna eat it. If you're thinking now, the traditional way of eating bunny chow is by hand, yeah. So we're gonna if you come a little closer now, this is how we're gonna start. You can get a little messy, I'm gonna start with a small bite though. Okay, let's go for the big bite. So you take a piece of bread, you know dip in a piece of nice mutton lamb. Wow. Oh my god. There is so, so many flavors. The first bite. Honestly, I feel home. I mean the curries, you know. I mean who doesn't love curries? <coughs> so a lot of flavors, a lot of spices and uh, the lamb, the mutton, if you see very tender like this is how it breaks like just the piece you know mm, very nice so this is how bunny chow has to be eaten Durban is the home of it yeah this is where the bunny chow was invented yeah it's amazing thank you also one thing what you can do is you can have your bunny chow with a coke I think that's what it goes very well to balance all the spices and all and I'm gonna eat my bunny chow now yeah thank you so as as you can see we have uh, almost halfway there with bunny chow now if you're wondering the name bunny chow yeah it's okay it's not rabbit all right it has nothing to do with the rabbit the word bunny chow originates um, we have to go two centuries back so the indian community came here 200 years back and the banyas which are the merchants hindi may we call them banya they used to it was two go dish it was invented by them and from the name banya came bunny and that's how bunny chow got its name and the bread which i was telling you uh, which was in the center they would normally give you on the side so we're gonna go now and uh, we can actually another way of eating this is just dip in this you see the curries um, it's, it's a little hot as well blown so if you want to feel India, outside India, my friend, have bunny chow in Durban. It's like. So, I didn't manage to finish most of the bunny chow. And uh, my overall experience was, I think, amazing. You know, it's been a dream since 2008 when I first saw bunny chow on uh, Discovery Channel. And finally had it in the home of bunny chow, Durban. Yeah. So if you do come to Durban, please come and try the bunny chow. This place is called Hollywood Pets. It's amazing. 
and do try the lamb one. They do have chicken and for the people who are vegan or vegetarians, we have sugar bunny. Thank you.